Hi, you're welcome to Jones in Praise TV. This is your digital classroom. Our aim is to help you make a very good grade in your IAs and your exams. So um, if you are just joining us, kindly make sure you subscribe to my channel. If you have not subscribed to my channel before, please click on the subscribe button to subscribe to my channel and also turn on your notification to get for subsequent videos i'll drop a link under the video you can click on the link click on the link it will send you to my whatsapp page that's my whatsapp channel it's not a page but rather my channel on whatsapp so every video i release i send the link there so you can get access to the videos i release there um before i start you know um, I've been much interest. Uh, I have much interest in the things that normally happens here, and I see most of you struggle to pay your school fees. I see most of you struggle to actually get access to information, and it is all because of leadership. So, um, what am I trying to say? There is an upcoming SLC election, which will be happening just on twenty sixth of August. So, please. Um, I have scrutinized, I've scrutinized all the candidates and I've seen that Jalit and then Guru are the ideal candidates. I've seen Jalit and Guru advocate for extension of school fees. Some of you enjoyed it, but you didn't know the people that did that. I've seen them advocate for, um, um, um actually support, okay, to, to support your colleagues who, who have not been able to pay their school fees. That's the Jalit and sub policy you see they've done a lot and 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 i've seen most of their policies okay i've gone through their policies for distance and other uh, campuses and i can see that they are the ideal candidate for you so please do well to vote for them and i have one of my daughter also contesting for the position she's in the person of lorinda okay so let me show her picture to you here she's in the person of lorinda please make sure you vote for it so this is guru guru maradona ajay Eboa. so he's going for president and jail it going for um vice president they are the ideal candidate for you and also my daughter is also here lorinda Owe, um yaye the rest of the please just yes, it's lorinda Owe. okay the name i can't mention but she's my daughter contesting for src president if you love johnson praise please give her the mandate vote for lorinda for me and make sure you vote for guru and jail it also for me um and please um there are people of there are some of you that want to go outside i have an off i have i'm working on a germany offer for people that want to go to germany okay but i'll do the processing this time around i'm doing everything so i'm doing the processing for you when i'm done you pay my money for me do you get it so if you're interested whatsapp this number okay don't whatsapp my normal whatsapp okay whatsapp me on this number 0503 it is only germany offer the other offers i'm working on it if everything goes through i'll let you know and um that is just by the way so we are going through ugbs 102 okay UGBS 102 Pascal review and I'll be releasing two videos okay maximum will be three but this is the first part be expecting the second part later in the day or tomorrow okay and please if you have been watching videos and you are not sharing please share we don't get anything in doing this thing so but the idea is to help you that is a fact maybe some of you think we make thousands of monies and stuff but that's it that's not true okay if i tell you you know even i don't even make a penny from what i'm doing here eh? so i i that is it so please just make sure you share it and if someone gets e and and becomes happy i also become happy with that so that is it um let's look at it number one it says that um a program a dash is what a program that organize analyze and and what and graph numeric data so which of the pro which of them are we talking about a processor word processor b database management system c a spreadsheet and then the pre uh, presentation software so the answer is what spreadsheet so spreadsheet is a program that 
organize analyze and graph numeric data are you okay let's move on to number two these computers are arranged from least powerful to to most powerful that is micro computer mid-range computer mainframe computer and supercomputer so the answer is true yes that's correct okay so number three it says that the machine cycle instructions are organized as follows a fetch process store and decode b fetch store process and decode c fetch store process and decode and then d we have fetch decode process and then store so the answer is what d that is fetch decode process and then store let's look at number four the difference between non-volatile memory and storage is that the memory is stash and then storage is that so a memory is temporary memory is temporary and storage is is um permanent b a b memory is permanent and storage is temporary c memory is slow and storage is uh fast a d none of the above so the answer is the answer is what e so memory is what memory is temporary and then storage is what permanent number five a dash is a collection of individual programs available together as a unit so which one are we talking about the answer is what software suit a the answer is a software suit number six a dash is a single chip with two or more separate processes processor calls okay so the answer so we have multitasking processing uh, processor we have multi-core processor c is what multi multi sa processor and then we have multi-processor core the answer is b that is what multi-core processor multi-core processor number seven dash and number seven in order to view pages pages on a website the user needs to enter the site address called a uniform resource locator b email address c postal address d mac address the answer is uniform resource locator that is url url okay url the uniform resource locator number eight registers are small high speed circuits used to store data instructions and memory addresses true or false so yes the answer is short true so register is what it's a high speed it's a high speed circuit used to store used to store data instructions and memory addresses number nine dash number nine the dash interpret each instructions issued by program and then initiate the appropriate actions to carry out the instruction a arithmetic logic unit b control unit c we have uh system unit and then the memory so it's what it interpret it interpret uh, instructions issued by the issued by what by a program and then initiate the appropriate actions the appropriate action to carry on so that is what the control unit the answer is the control unit let's look at um number nine, number 10 memory stores dash operating system b um b application program c data uh, data being processed by the application programs and then so that was c and then d is what all of the best so the answer is all of the best so memory it stores what operating op operating system application system and then data being processed by the application program so number 12 dash is a is a service that carries voice data video and multimedia at a extremely high speed. So we have A, T carrier, B, FT, FTTP, C, ATM, and then D, ISTN. So the answer is ATM. It's a, it's a service that carries voice, data, video, and, multi and multimedia at extremely high speeds. Number 13, the analog computer deals directly with A, number or quotes b measured values of continuous physical magnitude c signals in the form of zero to one and then d signals in discrete values from zero to nine the answer is b measured values of continuous physical magnitude number 14 
all these uh, communication devices except a modem b wireless access point that's what c router and then the keyboard so the answer is what keyboard all of them are communication device keyboard is not a communication device number 15 communication line between cpu memory and peripheral is called a bus c line d s a a, a bus b line c media and then d none of these so the answer is what a bus so is a communication between the cpu memory and peripheral and peripherals number 16 the content aggregating website as rss stands for in the content aggregating website rss stands for a read system syndication b which uh, routing syndication c uh, read simple syndication and the really simple syndication the answer is what really simple syndication number 17 dash is the process of converting data the process of converting data that is readable by humans into encoded character to prevent unauthorized access a um i got uh, what i got it <laughs> how do you call it <laughs> But uh, algorithm, right? <laughs> Forgive me if I'm not able to pronounce it well. We have B, cipher test, C, syndic uh, encryption, and then D, decryption. The answer is what? Encryption. You know, the encryption, when you open your website, you say your web, your WhatsApp, you say your, what, your messages have been encrypted, right? So the process of converting data that is readable by humans into encoded characters to prevent unauthorized access so it prevent people from hacking your whatsapp messages let's look at number 18 18 which of these which of the following is part of the system unit a monitor b motherboard c keyboard and then d none of their best so the answer is motherboard motherboard is part of the system unit number 19 dash may be defined as illegal activity which the person uses special knowledge of computer technology so a internet crime b computer crime c online crime and then d cyber crime so it is a, a cyber crime number 20 how many bits is how many bits is a kilobyte a thousand bits b thousand and twenty four c eight thousand and eight thousand one hundred and ninety two and then D eight thousand one hundred and twenty four. The answer is B. That is thousand and twenty four. That's one zero two four. Number twenty one. Dash is a protocol that defines how work uses the radio signals to communicate. When a tag place place in or attach to an object, an animal or a person. So the answer is A. Wi Fi. B. In internet. C. Bluetooth. And then D. Um, RFI, uh, D, IRF, uh, so the answer is what? RFID, RFID. So RFID is a protocol that defines how the, how the network uses radio signals to communicate with a, with a tag place, place in or attached to an object, an animal or a person. Number 22, all these are functions of operating systems except A, providing a user interface, B, manage program c data input and then uh, c is your data input and d schedule job so the answer here is what data input all of them are functions of operating systems reception of our data input okay um number 23 how many bits or binary award are allocated for a character on a computer or on a what on a computer on a on a computer keyboard so how many bits okay are allocated for a character in a binary or, or a, on on a computer keyboard okay so number um here i think um that's seven or eight okay uh i'm sure it's eight right it's either seven or eight but i'll confirm the answer is what um seven seven fourteen fourteen plus fourteen will be twenty one okay no that's eight eight sixteen plus 
So the, the answer is seven. Yes, it's seven. It's seven. But it's if not seven, it's eight. But I'm certain that it's seven. Number twenty-four. Number twenty-four. Dash is is the amount of time it takes. Okay, dash is the amount of time it takes the processor to read the memory. A access time. B clock time. C real uh, cycle time and then the cycle per second down sign is access time so is the amount of time mm. it takes the processor to read from the memory and then number 25 which of the following is not a type of a computer network a local area network b wide area network c personal area network and then d none of the abet the answer is none of the abet all of them are part Number 26. How many how many bits are in the term I like computing? Excluding the quotation marks. So I like computing. Which was we have what? A we have 23, 24, 16, and then we have 26. So um it's going to be I like computing. I like computing. Okay, if you exclude it. It's going to be, um, yes, 24. It's 24. So let's proceed. But you can confirm, okay? You can confirm and see. But I'll, I I think it's 24. Number 27. Mass produce copyrighted software that meets the needs of variety of users is called A, custom software, software B, package software C, freeware, D share well so that answer is what package software number 28 a computer can be defined as an electronic device that can okay choose the most precise definition so we have what that can carry out arithmetic B that can carry out logical function C accept and process data using a set of stored instruction and then D represent information so the answer is what c that is what accept and um, accept and process data using a set of stored inf instruction number 28 number 29 which of the following is not a business software a word processing b spreadsheet c presentation and d personal finance so the answer is what a personal finance personal finance is not an example of business software it is someone's personal uh, um, it, can, it contains someone's personal information Number 30, the type of education in which students learn by using using and, com and completing exercises with instruction software is called A, computer-based training, C, distance learning, D, web-based training, SAC, web-based based training, and then D, computer-aided graphics. The answer is what? CBT, that is computer-based training. Number 31, which is the last one, the part two will come. So which of the following holds the room CPU and RAM a CPU RAM and an expansion cards A hard disk B floppy disk C motherboard and then D none of the are bad. The answer is the motherboard. It holds the the room the CPU RAM and the expansion cards. Okay, so that just by the way, please um when you are voting remember to vote for guru and jlit okay most of the past questions i normally bring to you comes from jlit and i'm supporting jlit it's not because i've gone for money from him but i see the good works he has been doing okay he makes past questions always available for you and and that is it so i'm supporting not because of guru i'm supporting because of jlit and this lady is my daughter i train her so please vote for her God bless you for watch out for part two. Thank you for your time.